Hey guys and welcome back to Treasure Hunter Simulator where we are going somewhere. Ah, Johann Schmidt. Based on information we received this morning, you've started working with the second of Sir Richard's contacts, Global Antiques. Keep an eye out, blah blah blah. Uh, take a photo of the waterfall. That's it. You want a photo of that one? Okay. Uh, thank you for all your work regarding the previous offer. We're happy with the results. Make sure that I can find the buyers. Uh, as you may or may not know, Global Antiques also offers service on the internet. Their hand requires to expand to usual activities. Website needs to attract clients. Uh, we're looking for someone to take a picture of the waterfall. Okay, I'll do that. And this is still Gettysburg stuff. Which we ain't there. We are at... Oh, why? That, that's still gonna cost me... That's still gonna cost me 50 bucks to get there. Rude. Do I have any other junk or do I sell it? No, no, I've got junk. Eh... Uh, my pickle help? Patient saw, okay. Uh, let's travel here then. Eh... Uh, oh, I don't have any equipped. Oh no, I've got this one equipped. They can find large ones. Okay. Let's travel here, we'll take a picture and we'll see if we can find anything. Okay, we need to take a picture of a waterfall, and that's about it. Maybe we'll find treasure, but I doubt it. Yay, yeah, obviously need to follow the water round. Got a blue one this way. Yeah, with any luck we'll find even one large treasure would make me happy. I don't know if they're worth more or what, you know? I think we need to go this way anyway. Still getting closer. Oh! Nice! Got a big one. We got a biggie. What's it gonna be? It looks like it's a saw blade. A bear trap. It's trash. It's a bear trap. What's a blade of a handsaw? Common enough tool. Shh. Uh, $17. It's a blade of a woodworking handsaw missing the curved wooden handle or possibly even plastic grip that attached to both ends of the blades. Common, modern tool, not a valuable find. So it's a treasure. Why would you lie to me? You tell me I found treasure. This is not treasure. Oh, I know where we are. I need to cross over that bridge. Just run around here just now and see if we can find. There's some more treasure. No. Flame! Music in this game is so chilling. Chilly willing. Yours, mate. Alright, just need to keep going up here to get to the freaking waterfall. Oh. 
That's the thing now that now that uh, the travel actually costs me. I need to make sure that I earn like 50 bucks worth of stuff. Because currently we just earned 17. Being great. Oh, what is this? Some tongs. Hey, 22 bucks. Blacksmith tongs from the early 20th century. According to the chapters of the Father's a compilation of Jewish ethical teachings and maxims, the first pair of tongs were created by God, right before God rested on the seventh day. So the blacksmiths could use the first pair to make other pairs, as they couldn't possibly forge anything without having a pair of tongs to handle the heat of forged iron. Except the fact that they would just use two wooden sticks, but okay. I understand. <laughs> almost got enough to pay for the, the trip. Oh, it's another one. Uh, I think that's all has got enough to pay for the trip now. Could be wrong. Okay, wait, anyway, where have we went? Oh, okay, we need to come all the way up here. I could have just crossed through the... I threw the hills and got to the waterfall a lot quicker, but apparently not. Going a long way so that we can try and pay for this trip. Although I think the job of taking the picture is probably going to be... ...money enough. Yeah, I thought the, the travel fees would have been for, um, like, I thought that you would be in a specific location and then travel to and from, but apparently not. We can't really do those Gettysburg jobs, because it's very bloody expensive until... We're at that point. Not that one. Up. No. That was the entire point. What the fuck's your job? Take a photo of the, the waterfall. This waterfall. That they already have a photo of. Quite clearly, they have a photo of this waterfall. Oh, it wants me to take it from over there. Okay. So yeah, I really could have done it a lot quicker. Yeah, two seconds, I'll just take this photo with my iPad. Okay. Okay. Yes, return to office. Apparently I just got an achievement. Alright, email. Good morning, evening. One of our clients has a, uh, recently contacted us regarding a long forgotten artifact. Documents forwarded to us quickly, learned items. The Ulfbirth Sword! Highly valued item. Okay.
Wait, is that... Looks like there's a castle on the... Kitchen castle location unlocked. Wait, wait, wait. Is it still here? Or is it just... Oh, it's still there, I think. I mean, I should probably take these two jobs as well, really. Right, I need to sell some of this junk. Uh, they're fine. Okay. Keep all my fancy junk. It's my fancy junk. Yeah, Ulfbear Swords, yeah. It's definitely there. Or was that a reward that we unlocked a castle or something? I what these big fucking circles is. Anyway, jobs. Let's have a look at this attachment again. I wonder what all this shit is. So we need to look up. Because that's quite a distinct, like... ...shape to that. And that's just gravel there. Is it like here? I think the little story says that you got lost in the mountain passes. Definitely looks like it's corrupt. Definitely looks like it's gravel on the ground. Turns out I just happened upon it there. No. I'm sure it would have been quite obvious. Yeah, that's just another fucking saw blade. There's definitely some... I wonder if it's... Maybe around this area? Oh, I, was, I was checking the gravel, wasn't I? You, attachment one. Yeah, that's definitely gravel on the ground. Um yeah, I reckon that's where we need to go there. How do I get across there? Ah, oh, there's a bridge up. All right. Let's go this way.
definitely here. There we go. Digging, digging. What is that? A rocket ship? What the hell is it? A mortar? This is an unexploded mortar. It's a fucking mace. It's a medieval mace. Sixteen bucks for a fucking mace like that? Are you kidding me? A flange mace from the 15th century. Judging by its design, it was not a weapon of a soldier, but rather a knight or a nobleman. The late mace designs were much, were as much about function as they were about what we'd refer to today as design. Compared to normal maces that found throughout Europe, beginning with the late 12th century, maces like this one are rather rare and a lot more valuable among collectors. But it's only worth 16 bucks. Stupid. Yeah, apparently we can't actually get. Oh, we can over here. Okay, so let's. About turn and head back that way, maybe. Coming the opposite way. Yeah, I, I haven't actually explored that area. Yeah, I never went to the left. Here. To be honest, I didn't even realise you could. It's obviously got something to do with this area. I hope. Nothing. Hmm. Really would have thought that it was uh, something to do with that. Definitely, there's gravel on the ground. There's something poking about above us. Some weird round rocks that make it look like a. It's like a castle or something. The sword. Unless that's just a tree. This thing is a bit I don't understand. This is definitely rocks. A fern. Not sure, is it? I wonder if it's that little. Ruined house. So I think I know there's going to be gravel there. So, right, we're up here now. I haven't been this way either. How <laughs> many ways have not been? I know this is where you start, isn't it? Ah, this is where you start. Bloody numpty. I don't run that way. Been here. I'm so fucking confused.
All right. I thought the sword would have been a, a quickie. Evidently not. It's so lost in this place, so bloody big. So I went up and round there. Been up and round that way. And that's the, the crossy thing. So I don't know if that's... Dug it, dug it, dug it. That's the right way. So that's up and into the, the hills. We can go down this way though. No, we cannot. Alright. Turns out the reason I can't find it is because I've got the wrong fucking metal detector. around here. Just follow this road round and then head towards the the marker. And that gets us to that little ruined house. That I assumed Oh that cross there have I been there? Yeah, I have. Yeah that I assumed would be the the place for it, but apparently not. Yes, I know there's no treasures nearby. My hand twitched. Leave me alone. <laughs> Alright, let's... Excuse me. Let's pop this way. Let's see what's around here. Doesn't look like it. Anything up this hill? No, nope, nothing around here anyway. Didn't expect that, because like I said, it's got there's there's quite obvious gravel on the ground around it. So let's cross over here and head along this way. Yeah, I don't think it's going to be through that mountain path. So let's head to the left and we'll follow the, the gravel. See what I seen. Not a fucking saw blade. This place is worthless. Oh, beautiful saw blade. Great. Okay, don't be another saw blade, please. For the love of all that is good and holy. Looks like another saw blade to me. Oh no, it's not. It's rusty as fuck, whatever it is. Oh, it's an iron hook. A modern hook, not worth much, most likely one used for 
packing or just hanging various materials. Good day. Yeah, so right in front of me. Ah, okay. Right, so maybe it is somewhere. Along this mountain pass. Because it does get pretty high in here. So maybe that swings quite close to one of them. Definitely gravel. There's ferns. Might. Might be on a winner here. Like maybe if we we hug this left hand side here. That's where they all seem to be, is it not? Let me just double check. Yeah, I mean there was one on the right there. I didn't really see it though. Hmm, there's one way up there. Now oh, look at that tear. I can see through the planet do to the core. The fuck is that? My god, like, you can see where the Unity program, the, the level was started in Unity. Look at the little checkerboard, see it? <laughs> oh god, six. Yeah, it looks. I swear that's what we've seen. That's what that looks like. It just looks a lot... Oh, man, it doesn't really give as much, does it? Pokey overhang. Gravel and a fern. And what could be trees or turrets. No, it ain't fucking great. It ain't fucking great. I still don't, like... This is the thing that confuses the shit out of me. I don't know what this is supposed to be. It's mostly like a sheer cliff. Is it the actual thing of any? the attachments for any clues. It's fucking waste of fucking time. Literally just walking around any fucking gravel now to try and find this stupid ass thing. Some gravel over here. I'm gonna end up doing that thing where I literally have to zigzag the entire fucking map. Try and find it. Thank you. 
At least the music ain't too bad. Oh, that is no fucking gravel there. Hello? Hello, treasure. I keep you safe. So it's only really this bit of the the path here. I mean, there's no. I gotta say, unless you're on the path, there's no real gravel areas. I mean, there's duff, but there's no. That shit's definitely gravelly. Raveling up against a cliff, you know. Well, we can walk the the last section here. See if we can find that. So that's where we fucking stopped. We stopped just up here. Something tells me that this ain't gonna find it. Uh, it's gonna be another fucking saw blade or something. Some pish. Yeah. I need a saw blade, I need a sword. I don't fucking know. Sheer cliff. Tree? No idea. God knows what this bit is. Gravel. Not duff. Quite obviously gravel. So we can't really get anywhere else there. This is more around here, or maybe I can walk up against the cliff here. These are quite sheer cliffs. I guess. Head over there, there. Just hug the cliff. When all else fails, hug the cliff. And go everywhere you have not been. We'll give you a clue. It's like, what fucking clue are you giving me? Climbing this fucking mountain like a Skyrim horse. There's, there's nothing up here! Look, I just crossed over this! Unless I can, like, get into this area. I think you're supposed to.
Oh, I'm giving up. I don't fucking find this thing. What the fuck's it called? Where is it? The... Ulfbirth Sword. Right. Fucking... No. Fuck off. I want Google. Treasure Hunter Simulator Ulf... Ulfbeth Sword. Swirod. There we go. Mute. What the fuck? Well, that's fucking obvious. How the fuck? It didn't. It didn't show me on the map. I'm just. I don't think you could get that fucking close to those. Oh my sweet buddy Jesus, get me out of this fucking tree hell that I found myself in. The fuck am I? Oh. What the fuck did I get? Let's head over this way and cross over this. Okay, I think I may have just sucked myself. Am, am I OB? I think I'm out of bounds. That's weird, look at the, the, gra the ground. Yeah, I, I've got myself out of bounds. Great, unstuck. Thank you. Oh, it fucking teleports you back to the start, you cunting arsehole. Right, how the fuck do I get over there? Ah, oh, he's going all the way up. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's just a slow fucking descent into madness. Stupid bloody game. It's fucking. Shitty fucking. Oh, it's so relaxing. Oh, you can walk around well in it is. Oh, oh, shut the fuck up. Fucking stupid. Try to find a fucking stupid sword and no one even fucking wants anyway. Can't even sell the fucking thing. It's all for dick measuring contests and fucking unlock new maps and shit. Push! Blood pressure is too high for this fucking game. It's supposed to be a relaxing game. Mm -mm. Eh -er. Survey says no, motherfucker. Great. It's alright, you walk for half an hour and you feel like you're making headway, and it's like, no, you've actually moved like half an inch on the mat. When I mean, you play on 40 inch TVs, half an inch ain't very fucking far. Let me assure you of that. Sunny Jim. Right, this way, hit the. Hit the bridge on the right hand side and then cross up in between the... The mountains. Is that the right way? Ah yes. Okay. I was right though. I was right about it being beside those uh, those towers. I was right about the, the curvature in the photograph. I just couldn't find it.
I still doubt we're going to find it. Even though I kind of cheated. Is that my guy's crouch walking or something? Can I get him some fucking Sonic boots? Hell, man. Ah, these two here. So I'm looking to the south here, 195. What the fuck? Where the fuck was this guy looking? Oh. Oh, okay. Perspective. That's how I fucking lost it. So they are in the image. Better fucking be it. And third time. No idea. Oh, fourth time? Fifth time? Yeah, it's definitely it. Oh man, what pain in the arse. Legendary Oath Breath Swords. Yay, shiny. Uh, based on its carbon composition, this is clearly the real Ulfbirth sword. Crafted in the 9th century, these swords were often being described as mythical, and today we know that this choice of name is truly deserved. Somehow in the 9th century, the bladesmiths of the north managed to create a steel quality which was not to, uh, which was not believed to have been possible until the industrial age. Key to the steel quality lies in the amount of carbon and can make or break a sword. If it's not controlled just the right amount, the sword will be either too soft or too brittle. It's not only required to find the right amount the right amount, but also the heat to heat the steel above 1600 degrees C, which was a major feat in itself. What resulted were extraordinary swords that were not only significantly stronger, but also lighter. So yeah. I think that was... There's no way that was the fucking image. Like, two seconds. Continue. Oh, I can't even look at the fucking image anymore. There's a fern, there's a tree, there's a thing, and then... Nah. Nah, I can't see- I can't really see how that was a fucking image. Ugh, God knows. We got it anyway. So, return to the office. Yes, fuck this shit. Kill me now. Okay. Let's have a look. A instrumental recovery of the sword, add an engagement, final report, okay. Now this guy wants me to go to an area in a new place. CLA, we're in Rondo, Poland location. If you are in the area, BNM is looking to update the maps. Okay, find the fastest route through the castle. I'll look for some plants. Hey! <coughs> bloody. Oh, bloody hell. Okay, so there's some large, there's a decent concentration of large ship. Uh, and we are not a high enough prestige to get a new one. Well, that'd be cool if you could, you'd be able to find a lot of stuff there, actually, with that one. Uh, but unfortunately, guys, that's all we've got time for in this episode. So as always, thanks a lot for watching. I've been Cedric. You've been awesome. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.